Erica has a question for us, a newbie question. What do you mean when you say my market? And I think oftentimes we're thinking of the general national real estate market, then the state market, then there's also lux and I don't want to answer the question for you, but we've got luxury homes versus starter homes. So uh, I think it's great if we can delve into this a little bit more. Well, Erica, that's a great question. So a market is actually an area. It's a place. So you think that you go to the grocery store, a lot of people call that the market, right? Well, it's the market of a whole bunch of different goods. And in fact, they have to have it all laid out because there's so much stuff in there just to help you even get organized going through the market. Well, in our world, we have a market and we're looking for a certain type of buyer and a certain type of seller. And there's certain things going on in their world. And as a result of those things going on in their world, they may be interested in selling today. Well, the market area that you will be looking at is what I call the target market. And that market is where you're going to spend your energy to focus on people coming. So let's think about your area grocery store. Your area grocery store does not advertise across town unless they're a chain, but your area grocery store, what are they doing? They're advertising to their market. So sometimes they have flyers that are put in people's uh, mailboxes and they have local advertising that only goes to the local market. Why? Because they want to attract people locally to their business. Well, we want to do exactly the same thing. So we do our marketing within our target area and we bring in our customers from there. And what's so great and amazing about that is the opportunity to connect with the community in very profound ways. In fact, that's one of the things, Erica, that I'm going to be covering at the Wealth Builder Workshop is ways that we connect with the community that get what we call no competition deals, meaning that nobody else is bidding on that property. Nobody else knows about that property. That property is not on the MLS. And so we love buying properties that way. And I'm going to be teaching you that on Saturday. Great question, Erica. 